Hello, I'm Richard with ev for You Custom Conversions. And we thought we'd give you a, a little overview of our most popular conversion. And that's the Porsche 911 912 series. And so today I'm standing here with a 1976 Porsche 912e. And we'll do a little walk around and talk about some of the options available on this very popular vehicle. So today we're saying goodbye to this car. In a short time the owner will come and pick it up. And from here it's going in to have uh, the air conditioning connected. After which it will go in and to the paint and body shop for complete restoration. But this is our, by far, our most popular conversion is the 911 series Porsche. And they're a great conversion. They're just a beautiful car. They handle well. Classic styling. And they just make a great conversion for multiple reasons. And one, they're, they're a fun car. And they're beautiful classic, but we do away with all of the downsides being the high maintenance air cooled engine. So let's take a look what you get instead. Under the bonnet, there's the battery box, and in this case, it has uh, 20 100 amp hour cells. The battery charger, the air conditioning unit and the air conditioning controller, auxiliary battery, DC to DC converter are all located under the bonnet. Under the deck lid in the back is where we have the motor and the remaining remaining cells in two saddle racks that straddle the, uh, the motor and bell housing. Whether it be a Porsche 912, 911, uh, 924, 944, they all have this basic uh, setup where some of the cells are in the front and some are in the rear. The rear ones straddle either the transaxle or the motor, depending on the vehicle. And they're all available with uh, a selection of different setups and that being you can have an AC system or you can have a DC system such as this one which features the uh, so this has the uh, warp 9 and the Curtis controller and you can have just uh, any number of combinations you can have the uh, warp 9 with the uh, the Soliton uh, Junior or the Soliton 1 you can have an AC setup. There's multiples of those to choose from. Basically, depends on what you want the car to do. Uh, different battery pack sizes. Uh, this is our most popular setup right here. This is the uh, 44 of the 100 amp hour cells for a 14.6 kilowatt hour pack, and there is far forward as you can go and they're as low as you can go without being seen from the back of the car. I don't like seeing exhaust or gas tanks or anything else hanging out from the bottom of the car. It's not attractive in my opinion. And so, we engineer all the conversions to feature both form and function. And if uh, an owner wants one that's really clean and you don't see any wiring, we set it up so you don't see any wiring. If you want one where it shows all the works like this guy wanted, you can see how everything goes together. It makes a great demonstration vehicle to show people how they work. 
And so there's just a great uh, variety of options. And so if you want the car to go fast, you want it to go, you know, long range, whatever the case may be, you can, uh, you can have it. And it's uh, all basically the same layout. We kind of pioneered this in 2008 with the uh, common component board uh, next to the firewall on the uh, Porsche and Volkswagen setups. And it makes for a very clean installation. So let me show you, I mean I love the Porsches, but let me show you what I drive every day and my personal favorite. Well here's my favorite. This is uh, the Volkswagen Carmen Ghia. Just another classic vehicle, classic lines, and a very practical conversion in that you have a vehicle that's going to hold its value. This is a, a classic in 1955. I mean, they were just a well accepted, beautiful car and they still are today. This one's our company demonstration vehicle. We take folks for rides, let people drive it. It goes to events all over the West. not been restored or anything this is just the way we purchased the vehicle but let's uh, let's show you the conversion this is a 1974 and in 1974 they had a package shelf not a rear seat and we replaced the package shelf and that's is where the batteries are located one spot right here and so it's about three inches higher than the package shelf was so we basically have all the same room in the vehicle as it had originally well this is the engine bay now the motor bay engine compartment wherever you like to call it again nothing hanging down nothing unsightly so when you're behind the vehicle it actually looks better than it did from the factory again this is available in either an AC or DC setup both have multiple uh, options as far as uh, size of motor, controller, this is the uh, most popular one. This setup with the uh, 4400 amp hour cells, you know, the 14.6 kilowatt hour pack, what we call our commuter package, is the most popular. It's under $20,000. Features the Impulse 9 motor which means we're, we don't have to cut any of the sheet metal on the classic car. It has the 500 amp Curtis controller. You can go with upgrades on this. You can go to uh, a uh, Evnetics controller. You can go to an AC50. You can do whatever you want. Go to a larger battery pack. We can install the 180 amp hour cells just adds a little bit of weight, batteries will be in the same spot again just takes a little bit more room but not that you'll ever notice and again this is our demonstration vehicle so it's set up so that people can see how it goes together and this is our typical layout the battery charger 
DC to DC converter auxiliary battery are up front. Sitting in the shop in our uh, staging area here, just sitting, waiting for its next outing, collecting dust and spider webs, unfortunately, is Bob, our battery operated bug. This is our marketing vehicle. Very popular conversion. This one features custom suspension, custom fenders, running boards, custom interior, and a beautiful red paint job currently covered with a layer of dust unfortunately. And we'll show you that all too familiar probably at this point, engine bay. There you have it. Clean, simple, reliable. Makes for a great commuter car. Just a great vehicle to enjoy a classic without the shortcomings of the original. No valves to adjust, no oil changes, no points, no carburetors. Never have a, a fuel fire with this setup. I've seen many a deck lid burned on a Volkswagen. Won't be dripping in your garage or your driveway. Clean, simple, reliable. I know, still got tailpipes on it. Strictly a conversation piece. Some people appreciate it. Some like to complain. This is a current project underway. And this is a vehicle that customers uh, allowed us to use in our videos so we're appreciative of that as I hope our viewers are and we'll show you this thing along the way in a recent video we showed you the battery rack being made which will slide out of the vehicle and be located down in the treasure chest sitting here waiting to be cleaned and painted ev for you was started with a single goal and that is to promote electric vehicles and it came from a love of automobiles and the desire to save the beautiful cars of the world and give them new life by converting them to electric. And in doing so, we make a vehicle that is much more efficient, much more reliable, and just an enjoyable vehicle to own and operate. And so to achieve that mission, we not only convert vehicles for those who don't want to do it themselves, but we provide tools for those who would like to do it themselves and experience the great joy in having a vehicle that you are intimately familiar with because you have designed and built the propulsion system yourself. And so we not only provide components 
We also provide educational videos. We provide workshops. And we provide assistance via email. Uh, we do get a lot of phone calls, but we'd appreciate it if you would send an email instead. Uh, it's easier for us to respond to emails than it is to be tied up in the phone all the time. Uh, we just have too many requests for information. But anyway, that's our objective. We're doing our best to meet it. And if we can be of any assistance, please contact us at info at ev for you now. Dot com. And stay tuned for more educational videos right around the corner. Thanks for watching.